so what we're going to do is we're going to compare the Smasher to the Smasher XL. These are the Smashers, the standard Smashers, and these are the XLs. 676, no. 680, yes. 676, no. 680, yes. 676, no. 680, yes. 676 no, 680 yes. 676 no, 680 yes. Okay, here's the XLs. 680 no, 682 no, 684 yes. 680 no, 682 yes. 680 no, 682 no, 684 yes. 680 no, 682 no, oh yeah that goes through, 682, 680, 682, 684, okay, I'm gonna make a sheet so you can fast forward to the end to see all the data. Smasher standard 860 no 855 0 0 858, 858, eight, eight, zero. All right, now here's the XL. 861, zero. 858, zero. 858, zero. 862, zero. 859, zero. Okay, those are the weights and diameters of the Snashers standards and the XLs. All right. Now what I'm going to do is uh, put them in an HDB 68 alternating balls and this is a special adapter to use a 25 gram CO2. So let's, let's get them. All right, I'm going to go with a XL. Standard XL, the standard, an XL, the standard XL, standard XL, standard. So the XLs are first, but they alternate, and then. Um, and then uh, the standard are next. All right, here's 25 gram CO2. Okay, we're charged. 
it's 64 degrees in here. Penetration tester is set up. Chronograph is on into FPS mode. Turn on the optics. Okay. We're at five meters. XL1. I didn't register. Standard one. XL2. Standard two. XL3. Standard three. XL four. Standard four. XL five. Standard five. Okay. Now let's uh, see what we get by the penetration tester. This is the spread. I'm trying to keep the spread apart. Nothing in two, nothing in four, nothing in six. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. Six at eight. Six at eight. And we have four at ten. Now I'm going to take the penetration tester apart so we can see which balls were where. All right. So we have all 10 balls. So um, I'm going to identify what's what. So we have six at eight. All right, so I gotta be able to reach in and get these. Remember, these are all eights. All right, this is an XL. This is an XL.
This is a standard. This is a standard. This is a standard. This is a standard. So it looks like we had um, four standards and two XLs. All right, now let's look at 10. That's an XL. That's an XL. That's an XL. That's a standard. Okay. So I'm gonna tabulate the results and show you, but it, it looks like the XL was able to do um, better in the penetration test. Again, no 12s, you can see, no 12s. Nothing made it past 10, okay? So here we're looking at the um, spec sheet of what transpired in the real world testing. The uh, standard smasher came in with a diameter of 0 0.680 inches while the XL Smasher came in at 0.6832 inches, about 3.2 thousandths greater diameter, which should help it in launchers that have a larger bore size. As far as mass, the Standard Smasher came in at an average of 8.562 grams, and the Smasher XL came in at 8.596 grams, slightly more weight. The uh, extra weight will uh, help it in more powerful launchers, give it more momentum, and add to the kinetic energy. The velocity, feet per second and joules, for the standard smasher, uh, came in, the joules came in at 11.09 on average, and the maximum feet per second was 177.1 for the standard smasher, and the minimum feet per second was 158.3. The maximum joules was 12.47, and the minimum joules was 9.97 for the standard smasher. As far as the smasher XL, the average joules was 11.896, the maximum feet per second was 181.4, and the minimum feet per second was 163.5. The max joules was 12.14, and the min joules was 10.67. So the Smasher XL was able to achieve about 0.9 greater joules than the standard Smasher. As far as penetration, momentum, the um, standard smasher had four balls at eight and one at 10 for a total score of 42. And the smasher XL had two balls at eight and three balls at 10 for a total score of 46. So this is telling me that the um, Umarex T4E HDB68 has a barrel size that's larger because the Smasher XL was able to perform better in it. This is going to be a function of the power of your launcher and the bore size of the launcher. So here are the two Smashers. The standard Smasher is on the left with a yellow star, and the Smasher XL is on the right with a blue-gray star. Both are available at lesslethalballistics.com and we offer free samples. You can get two balls in a small package. They're free. You just pay the shipping. Lesslethalballistics.com.
Thank you.